Okay, hi. Uh, this is Gary Kutumono. Uh I'm here to te uh, to teach you how to dump textures on on uh, for the Nintendo 64. Um, I'm I'll be using the plugin uh, from Rise, uh, Rise Video plugin. Uh, I prefer the the old version, not not the, the recompiled version. Uh, you, you can get it from Emu. Uh, uh, MU Talk, or whatever you call it. Um, uh, you can you can f find it uh, from the uh, 1964 subboard, or just the board and the high resolution texture projects board. Um, then you click on the be bet beta version uh, 6.1.1 beta 10, and there you have it. Um, you'll just download this one. Anyway, I already installed it, but if you haven't, uh, just place the plugin in the plugin folder. Start plugins, change plugins, and you can change it here. Okay, let's start up a, a ROM. Um, I'm refreshing the folder. Um, okay, I'm going to start up a game, but before I do that, um, I'll I'll check up. I'll check if some settings are set right. So uh, first, you go to plugins, video settings, uh, texture filters. Uh, you have to make sure this is unchecked. I usually I usually uncheck this one too, but anyway, make sure that this one is unchecked. Okay. Now let's start up a ROM. I'll I'll use Harvest Moon for this one because I haven't done anything with this. So I'll start up uh, Harvest Moon. Now you'll see some splash screens and such. I'll just start to start the actual ROM where you can actually see something. Okay, yeah, I think this is good. Then we go to f video settings and back to texture filters and click dump textures to, f to files. Uh, this plugin is actually used for. Um, for the high res uh, project, uh, you can replace every texture in the game f with high res textures. So anyway, um, I've uh, ripped, uh, actually I've dumped some textures from this game, or actually sprites. And uh, now we can stop the emulation and see what, what result it, is, it has. We go to the plugins folder. Then texture dump, <coughs> and you'll notice you know you'll notice uh, the Harvest Moon uh, directory is automatically created. Uh, the plugin automatically creates f uh, subfolders for every game you uh, texture dump. Th uh, this is needed for, for example, the high res uh, edition. Uh, I I have some high res Smash Brothers uh, textures. I'll show them later. But anyway, uh, you'll find several folders, but the, mo the two most important are these two. Uh, uh, CI by PNG and PNG All. Uh, you'll have to check both folders to see if the the sprites you're looking for are actually there. And anyway, it seems to be in this folder. And this folder seems empty. Anyway, um, I'm s I'm going sh to show you how the ra high res uh, option works now. Um, let's check again if texture dumps off. Then load high res textures if available. Um, 
I'm going to, s to see what exactly gets changed. Uh, big letters. The letters are, the letters are high res. For example, uh, in game, what's what gets changed? Um, stages. Uh, I'm going to run Yoshi's Island, the Yoshi's Island stage. Okay, anyway. It takes a while before it loads. Most often it doesn't do anything because... Okay, I'll have to restart. Okay, video settings. Texture options, load high res textures if available. Now it, it loads every uh, high res texture. And I'm going to show you how it actually looks up. like. And where you see some very smooth textures, I'm going to try and see if when disabling it actually changes it. Yes, it's changed it. It changes it. And let's see again the differences. High res of low res. And no, they're not going to change. But anyway, uh, this concludes the tutor tutorial. And uh, good day.